Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, and today I'm going to show you how to make water snakes, just like these. So, and I'll show you how to make them really cool. So first, you can get a plastic bag, and then you take the plastic bag and you can fill it with cold water. And about here, you can get a small plastic bag, I like these bags, to fill it about here. So then I'm gonna close the bag and I'm grabbing a piece of paper. It doesn't matter, you can have colored ones or regular white ones, it works either way. And then you're gonna grab some markers. So I got some markers and I'm gonna be coloring, making my water snake blue. So what you're gonna be doing is just coloring this whole sheet like blue, like this, and make sure you get the back too, like this. And then you're gonna take your um, paper and put it in this plastic bag, like this, and you're just gonna let it sink in for a little bit until it turns the color. So you could just wait a few minutes because it's already starting to turn blue, as you can see. So it's starting to turn really blue, so I'm just gonna wait a few more minutes until it gets really blue. So it got really blue, and now I'm gonna take the paper out. So you wanna carefully open the bag and make sure no water comes out, and take this paper out. Then you can just throw it away from here. So, so it should be looking like this. I think I'm gonna add a little bit more water. Okay, so I added some more water. And after that, you wanna carefully take all the air out. So you wanna make sure that you get no water. You, don't wanna, you wanna make sure you have no water spilling. So I'm carefully putting it down and just letting out the air kind of flattening it out. So now there's not really any air in. So after that, I like to um, double bag it just so it doesn't leak. And sometimes I even like triple bagging it just to make sure. Um, so I'm just carefully putting it in the bag so to make sure it doesn't leak or anything. Cause you don't want it leaking everywhere cause that'd be a disaster. So then after I put it in the bag, I just zip it up and I make sure that there's no air in the bag. There's still a little air, so. All right, now that there's no air in the bag, then once you double bag it, it should look like this. And be very careful when like, double bagging it or airing it out so you don't spill any water. So next, I like to take some tape and then I fold this over and I tape it like this. So this is how I tape it. I just go like this and I fold it over. So it's on, you know, side like that. And then I take tape and I just tape it down, don't worry, it's gonna look really good. Um, I just tape it down like this, and then I keep putting tape on it. Like this. So it should look something like this. So then that's how you make it and it comes out really cool. It's like a DIY water snake. And if you want to triple bag it, you can. I, I recommend double bagging it if you just did one bag, but I like triple bagging it sometimes. So if it starts leaking or if you just feel like you wanna triple bag it, just to be safe, you can. Um, and it's really fun. This is what it looks like from the back. Um, you can use any color, any kind of paper to um, dye the water. And this is how you make it and it's really fun to play with. And you can also add glitter, pom-poms, or like toys, small toys into this. Make sure it doesn't pop um, to make it cool. So that's how you make it. Bye guys.